this approach offers an efficient way to introduce other viral antigens into the HVT genome for rapid development of recombinant vaccines. The main advantage of this technique is that a GFP expression cassette is attached to the insert first for easy visualization and then removed by Crelox-P system. The same approach can be used to insert more viral genes at different locations of the HVT genome or other avian herpes viruses for the development of multivalent recombinant vaccines. Demonstrating the procedure will be Katie Moffat, an expert in cell sorting, Na Tang, Yao Yao Zhang, and Guang Guang Qiu, scientists from my laboratory. The day before transfection, prepare chick embryo fibroblasts as outlined in the text protocol. Seed 1.3 million cells in 2.5 milliliters of medium into each well of a six-well plate. Transfect the CEF cells with 0.5 micrograms each of the two Cas9 guide RNA plasmids and one microgram of the donor plasmid using an appropriate transfection reagent according to the manufacturer's instructions. Incubate the cells at 38.5 degrees Celsius with 5% carbon dioxide for 12 hours. 12 hours post-transfection, dilute the HVT virus stock with M199 culture medium to a concentration of 100,000 plaque-forming units per milliliter. Add 130 microliters of the diluted virus to each well of transfected cells. Set one well of untransfected.